Welcome back to Get Down to Business, the show all about small business, jobs, and entrepreneurship. It has been 175 years of the Stanger family in Naperville with an eighth generation on the way. I'm thrilled to be joined by Nick Stanger, um, who has launched a new company, the financial firm, the Stanger family office. Um, and Nick, it's an honor and pleasure to have you uh, on the program. Thanks so much for joining us. Yeah, thank you so much for having me and just uh, just a privilege to be here. Thank you. Absolutely. So let's talk with the past. We'll get to the present and then we'll talk about the future. How does that sound? Sounds awesome. Okay. So the past, your family, as mentioned a moment ago, has been around um, in Naperville in particular, but the Chicagoland area for quite a while. Uh, I believe some beer has been uh, has been a part of the mix. Let's uh, let's talk a little bit about why your family is so uh, so tied to Naperville and what you guys have been doing. Yeah, so it's it's uh, well, it, it it's been awesome, and and I'm a seventh generation Naperville guy, so our our family's been here for a little bit now, and uh, I don't not, not technically one of the founding families like the actual Naper family, but pretty pretty close after that, and uh, of course my my dad being the sixth generation, and then my grandpa. Uh, Jack, who passed a couple years ago, he was the fifth, and and uh, he was never as much uh, uh, on the history preservation side. It wasn't until my my dad really, who got heavily involved with Naperville Heritage Society and Naper Settlement, which is a, a big piece of what we do, and and uh, really trying to document the history that we've been able to do a lot of research and. Um, learn more about the brewery, and and that was a huge huge piece of the entrepreneurial past in our family. That's that's wild, and I know you have uh, taken your dad's place as uh, as a board member of the Naperville Heritage Society. So congratulations on that. And I know I hear the passion in your voice and uh, capturing the history, telling the story. But that leads us indeed to the present. So you're certainly active in community. Um, you are uh, you are married, um, wife of uh, just over two years, as I as I understand it. And you, uh, let's talk about your family and let's talk about your uh, your financial firm. Yeah, so no, that's that's exactly right. We got married a couple of years ago and kind of had a crazy COVID wedding situation and we're going to get married up here and ended up moving it down to Florida where we could be outside, which was which was a lot of fun and then now we've got our uh, uh, actually the 8th generation on the way coming up in a couple of weeks if everything is on time, but uh, the the we're, we're going to have a son here on May 1st, which is really uh, really coming up quickly. Wow! Congratulations on that, and I know you've uh, you've made a joke in the past that uh, with uh, with your wife, with Jamie, uh, nine months pregnant with the baby, um, you have been uh, pregnant as well with a, a project of your own. Let's talk a little bit about that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's exactly right. Yep, she's she's about nine months pregnant with the baby, and uh, for the past year now, we've been. Um, really doing our due diligence as a, a wealth management firm. And we actually just left one of the largest New York-based wealth management companies and launched our own firm. Uh, we called it Stenger Family Office. And uh, really the, the the background behind that is our family. And we've got sizable assets um, at, at the firm that have kind of grown over time. And and like a lot of our families that started small and and built, um, we we started to find out just for our own family that complexity was getting more and more uh, uh, advanced, and there's just a lot of things that needed to be done that couldn't be done in a in a traditional wealth management structure. So, um, part of our our new structure today is we've got tax people in house. We can do tax preparation. We've got attorneys in house. So we can help clients with estate planning, wills and trusts and all the rest of it. And so we started from that lens of how do we build this for our own family, for our, our future and put the right pieces in place and guardrails to continue passing our legacy down like we have for seven generations now. And and then we said, well, if we build it from that lens, maybe a couple of our clients would be interested in that as well. And and so far they have. And and uh, it's just been a wonderful, wonderful upgrade for our uh, our company. Indeed. So certainly you have been uh, hard at work in developing the Stanger family office um, and uh, family offices. That's something I know uh, I've had several family office leaders on this program in the past, and that's typically a 
ultra wealthy family uh, thing um, or resource that's available, but you've been able to, as you've been mentioning, um, deliver that experience. So let's talk about some of those services that you provide. Uh, I believe obviously there's there's a lot of information on your website, which we'll send our listeners to. But why why you, Nick? Why why what's the unique value proposition over here? Yeah, and and you're exactly right. The family office has been around for hundreds of years, and this has been this is not a new thing that we've invented at all. Um, It's been in existence for a while to help families pass their legacy down, not just the focus on investments or financial planning, but to put an entire team of experts around the family so that things don't get lost through the uh, things don't get slipped through the cracks, and that you have a tax plan, you have an estate plan, and and in the past you used to have to have hundreds of millions of dollars to do this. Well, today with technology, we built a family office that I would almost call a democratized offering. It's it's a family office for just regular people like us. And and so, of course, yes, we have ultra wealthy, high net worth clients, but a lot of our people in their in, in the kind of middle zone get left behind in in the wealth management world where not everything's looked at, not everything's coordinated properly. And so we said, let's build an experience. Let's build a family office where everybody can access it. So we've created four unique business lines with, within the core family office, Stinger Family Office brand. One gets people started with just $1,000. And that's literally how we built our business. My father, who started our company in the 80s, that's how he built it, was on small accounts that over time that we knew if, if we do, did a good job and walked alongside them and gave them good advice, they'd stay with us and grow. And that's exactly what's happened. So um, we have an offering for small investors. We have a core offering for people with 100,000 to 2 million. And that's our the core of what we do. And then of course, there's a family office zone. When you get over $2 million, we tend to throw in a pretty good credit towards tax preparation. So a lot of that's included. And then estate planning, there's a credit there. So um, what we've done is we've built a business where you can get started at any point in the financial journey and then grow with us over time. Absolutely. I'm chatting with Nick Stanger, the Chief Executive Officer and Financial Advisor at the Stanger Family Office. We've been chatting about some of the uh, some of the services provided, including wealth management, investment management, family office tax preparation, and estate planning for uh, their uh, family uh, of, uh, of clients, because I know that's how you treat it. Um, but Nick, it's not just you. You've got, a, uh, you've got a great team of people behind you, including an advisory board, as well as uh, some fantastic staff that make that possible. So uh, tell us a little bit about the team and, uh, and, and the experience that you bring uh, to the table. Yeah, well, it all started with my business partner, Bond Roth, and he's got a great name, Bond Roth. You cannot have a better name for a financial business than that. And there's a story behind that. You can listen. There's a podcast, actually, where we talk about it. But um, he's been a wonderful friend and business partner in all this, high integrity and just, just a wonderful guide as we've built this. And then, of course, we've got a frontline staff of people who do a lot of the day-to-day and operational work. We've got tax people, like I said, and estate planning people. And, and uh, you know, th- it's so important to build a team like we've done where the culture is, is, is critical. And of course, we, everybody talks about culture, but uh, it's kind of this intangible thing where uh, you don't really understand it until you're in a bad culture or until you're in a really good culture. And, and so what we're in today is a fantastic culture. We've got people with just high energy and and just really care about the client. And and so what we've been able to do with our new firm is just return to that client centric focus where it's all about entrepreneurship. It's all about innovation and how do we make the experience better? How do we improve client outcomes, not just punch a clock and go through the day and and count down the days till retirement. It's just a totally (laughs) different experience. Absolutely. Uh, Nick, uh, that's, uh, that's fantastic. Congratulations on all of that. And uh, I, I promised that we'd get to the future and we're just going to touch on this for a very, very brief moment before we have to cut to break. Um, but uh, again, very shortly, you are going to uh, bring in the eighth generation of the Stanger family to have Naperville roots. Uh, your son uh, will be born uh, uh, very, very shortly, I believe, uh, due on uh, May, May 1st. So that's exciting. Any chance that that brewery is going to be open either by you or your or your uh, new child? Well, it's certainly been something that people have been asking for for a long time. I guess TBD is the answer there. And uh, who knows, but we're certainly continuing along the entrepreneurial legacy and we're continuing on with the innovation and 
who knows what's in the uh, in the future here for our our uh, son but we'll see and and certainly the history preservation if you know where you've been you know where you are sure. and you know where you're going and uh, that that's what's so important right. to us Nick how can we get in touch with you and learn more about your family office and all of the amazing work you're doing in Naperville well, go on our website, www.stengerfamilyoffice.com. We've actually got our own podcast. We have the Nick Stenger Show. We've got a number of other shows and different types of content on there. Check us out. And if you want to get in touch, give us a call. 630-912-8295 is our direct line. Nick Stenger, thanks so much for joining us on the program. We'll be right back and get down to business.